So the Great Purge of Stone Hearth, or the Great Purge of Crack Fences is about to begin. I'm, I don't know if I woke up in like kind of an aggressive mood this morning, but I'm just ready to take out all the goblins, all the wolves, anything that's bad outside of the town, because there's too many reasons for us to not do this. Actually, I think I said that wrong. There are too many reasons for us to do this. And there's not enough reasons for us to sit back like we were doing. At this point, we need to do a lot of things outside of our village, and we've kind of begun to do that. I've kind of begun to do that over the break. Uh, I destroyed at least one goblin and at least one wolf, uh, giving me access to this chest out this way. We also need a lot of wood. We need a lot more wood resources, as well as I've got two footmen that are on the verge of leveling to level 3, which means we can turn them into archers or knights, uh, making them much more much more powerful. And really, it's going to be the only way we're going to stand up to the goblin encampments. Uh, not these little guys right here. Not, not these like little goblin fire pits. I'm talking about the big-ass goblin camps. That's the only way we're going to be able to take them on, is if we have like knights and archers and things like that. Uh, I also have a, my cleric up. Um, I did a little bit of, you know, uh, you know, customizations over here. Uh, now I have my, uh, the wooden safety standard so that if we have to, if we're forced to at one point, we can send all of the hearthlings to hide as far back, uh, and as safely as possible into, uh, the mines. So they can go into the mines of Moria and hide there. That's, I, I don't know if that's just like a temporary term that I'm going to use here or whatever, it doesn't matter. Uh, but yeah, we need more wood and uh, let's not forget that we still need to build the monument. We need the, uh, we need to complete the quest for a township, which we're going to go for Sid's Valor. Now, ach achieving net worth of 4,000 shouldn't be that big of a deal, but building uh, and placing the Valor of Sid is going to be a little bit harder since uh, it requires, let's see here. Let's just make sure that I know the requirements. First of all, the Mason's going to be the one to build it. Whoopsie. Um, uh oh, do we not have any more stone? We should, okay, well, let me stop everybody from doing this, but let me just make sure that I check on the, uh, the resources. Here it is, Valor of Sid. So, we need two Goblin Honor tokens. I actually wouldn't be surprised if we find one just laying on the ground someplace. And then, we could probably destroy this very Varanus, Varanus skin, little big bug thing. And I'm actually considering even going up to a fourth footman. I know that's kind of crazy, but, uh, I'm, I'm definitely, definitely considering it. All right, so I'm going to I'm going to dig out a little bit further. Maybe to there. Actually no, we need to go to there. Let's just get a few more stone resources. Uh, I got a bunch of chests, so you know, our stockpile is super safe and super sexy right there looking all good. And I'd like to do kind of the same formation uh, right here. Maybe we'll put additional croplands because something like that. As well as I think I want to start to build the wall. I don't want to just be stay stay hidden behind these uh, these fences. I'd like to kind of build a a wall giving us a little bit more room to build smaller houses or, I don't know, smaller man mansions or something like that, I don't know. Anyways, um, so let's let's go ahead and collect all these resources out this way, which is actually probably not the best of ideas now that I realize, now that I think about it. Well, let's just dig that out anyways. And uh, here we go, daily update, let's see if we can pass this, nice, we did. Alright, so I will accept them, hopefully they pop up not on the second floor. Nice, perfect, perfect. I was gonna say, please don't pop up over, he over here when we're totally not ready for it. Oh my gosh! Okay, so we've got two giant zombies over this way. So I'm gonna I'm gonna instruct my uh, my my soldiers to go and destroy this while we can. So let's go ahead and send them out this way. Uh, we also need to make sure that we actually grab this. Um, we we have, we've got to we've got to actually loot this thing. There we go. Boom. Oh no! Do we have to we have to kill it? Don't we? All right, we'll come back and do that. And I actually would like to uh, well, wolf pelt. We could use a little bit of additional wolf pelt. Um, all right, yeah, let's go with that. We did just get a new hearthling, which means that I can name somebody down in the comments below. So let me go ahead and do that too while everything is taking place. I don't believe there are any baddies over this way. Yeah, we should be fine. Yeah, they just totally destroyed somebody. And uh, resources everywhere just gather up all these resources baby yeah because we were continuing to run out of wood and again that placement for a level six farmer then you can you know start to grow the oak saplings that's really difficult that's crazy so yeah i i, I don't know that really messes with us nice samuel jackson okay so let me name um who is a new person uh alex okay nice sexy beard alex i love it looking good all right, um, let's go ahead and go with uh, Error Unknown. I like that name. All right, Error un Unknown. There you go. Nice body. Nice body Error Unknown. Uh, <laughs> but, uh, yeah, I'm liking that. Not as good as Miley Cyrus's body, though. Because everybody likes to <laughs> refer to that. 
All right, so we're gonna we're gonna dig this stuff down. Let's also make sure that we send out our party to go and kill this. There we go. That means we're gonna be able to loot a, a lot more stuff, and we're we're probably gonna be pretty open to an attack for a while. I don't plan on kind of going back inside of uh, behind our fences for a long time. I think so. I'm gonna I'm gonna make sure that the preparations are in place so that we can build at least a fourth, maybe even a fifth footman at some point. So let's go ahead and do that, as well as, I mean, we might as well build the, uh, build the necessary tools to make sure that, oh, wait, what? Oh, we don't have any of the stone still. Well, I guess that's kind of good that people are focusing, oh, no, wait, what? Are we building stone that fast? We might be. Okay, well, let me just make, like, kind of the equal design this way. I think about there. Yeah, let's do something like that. And then we already know it wants we want to come out this way. Uh, that's not the same width, but you know we'll figure it out a little bit later. We know it's gonna go like here, and then I'll yeah, that's how that's how we built it originally. Okay, yeah, let's just leave it like that. So you guys start digging there. Uh oh, it's time to eat. Uh, I know it's time to eat, but you know there's still a lot of things on the agenda. I don't know if you heard about the uh, Hearthling agenda, but uh, there's there's it's it's the new. You didn't get the newsletter? All right, let's make sure that we also get this. Boom. Okay, what is this that we get? Okay, rough wooden buckler. Now what we need is those goblin metals. We've got to kill goblins for that, and probably. I mean, I don't. I really don't want to open up the second level here. And have to go fight these guys too. But uh, I mean I will. I mean this this area is going to be pretty safe for the most part. Because these giant zombies are not going to move. And this is kind of a small choke point for any of our enemies. Any of these enemies over here towards uh, the west. The east we're, we're going to have to take on these wolves. And actually they might go away at some point. I'm actually hoping they just go away. Because I'd rather not fight three wolves. They're fast and they're, they're going to be hard to take down. Nice. Level 4 Miley Cyrus. I like it. Yes, I I very much like it. Yep, yeah, I can hear us. I can hear us mining, and that's kind of a lot of mining that they're they're going to be doing. Okay, so where are they where are they approaching? Nice. Okay, so they're on the second level. Now, what kind of invaders are they? And I guess I'm not correct in saying that. I thought we were going to be safe. Oh, geez, more wolves, and then we have got this little stone uh, golem, which is interesting that the wolves and the stone golem are not fighting. That is kind of interesting. So I'm going to leave them alone. Again, the wolves are. I don't really want to mess with the wolves. If we can keep this bottom portion safe, then uh, then I will try to do that. What is this? Uh, interested in making eight mean beds. I'll be back in three days in exchange for three bolts of cloth. No, I'm good. No, thank you. I've actually got the carpenter working on a lot of things right now. So, okay, so there we are. We don't. We're not fighting anything else, and also we didn't level up at all, which is kind of weird. But I need to keep those. I need to keep those footmen open to be able to do things. So I'm not really going to... I'm not going to have them go up and fight the, the second level bad guys just yet. I, I want to make sure that... I, you know, to be honest, I just want to take down all of these trees. Now that we're here, now that we've, you know, eliminated any threat... You know, also what we could do is bring these berry bushes inside. Or these turnips, I guess. No, no, they're not turnips. They're, they are berry bushes. I've made that mistake in the past before, and I apologize. <laughs> okay, good. Next day. Uh, what are we doing in terms of uh, net worth? Net worth is not the best. I think we're going to begin building our, our our great wall pretty soon. Let's take down all this stuff. I, I just want to clear all this stuff out. Okay, so no net worth, which means that we need to start building the wall either way. Uh, jeez. There's still so much to do, though. I don't know if I want to build the wall. I don't know if I want to. Do we have to? We do have to build the wall. And that's, not, that's not the only way to bring up our net worth. And we could always place just like a, you know, small building out, you know, this way. Or, build, or a big building, either way. Big building would work, too. Uh, I don't think I'm going to do a big building. I think we'll modify a tiny cottage. Yeah, we need to we need to get the net worth up a little bit more. I don't okay, well wait a second. Oh. Oh nice. Oh my gosh. Now that is a stone golem. I actually don't know who would win in a fight. 
between these two. He has a little buddy helping him out, though. Alright, so the stone golem is nothing to be messed with. This dude just took down... He's about to take down two giant zombies on his own. Do not mess with the stone golems. Alright, we are definitely not going up there. Dang, he just, like, punched that treasure chest in the face. And it just evaporated in thin air. Like, that's how strong this guy is. I really hope that they don't pop up down this way. Really don't want to mess with things like that. But, uh, we will see. Now, the more trees we destroy, the less, uh, the further away the baddies will have to spawn. So, me chopping down these trees is actually a good thing, because then they got to spawn even further back. Um, that's why, like, whenever you make, whenever I do, like, do, like, an oak tree farm or something like that, I always have to kind of cut them down at a, at a certain point, or else bad guys will spawn, uh, in this, like, artificial forest that sometimes I end up creating accidentally. So, is our herbalist able to do anything? Because I want to make sure that we're... Staying up to speed and making sure that our, our all of our all of our soldiers are pretty strong. We we also get got to give them a, a level up here. Yeah, so these bandages will work. I've got the silkweed. Yeah, we've got the resources. We just got to level them up. So hopefully that will be enough to uh, level up level up our, our herbalist. Okay, yeah. So we definitely need to we need to slow down here a little bit. We're on day thirteen. Let's build our tiny cottage, and I will build the tiny cottage outside of, uh, because I just don't think it will look, I think it would look weird if I try to slam it in here. Let's, uh, yeah, let's build it like that, and then let's kind of, let's kind of mess with this a little bit. Let's erase this and this, like this, you know, it's a nice, like, 8x8 eight eight sort of thing, but I'd like... Something a little bit more. Can I build that? Oh, I can. Wow, that's pretty. That's pretty cool. Let's go reinforce door since it is outside of the uh, outside of the fences, and I don't really know what would happen. I know that some baddies will try to knock down the the, uh, the door. I just don't know which ones. There are some of them, like the stone golem, will definitely bust through that thing like nothing. All right, so let's just build this like that. We'll build a nice other window right here. I think I'd like an additional door for maybe a, uh, maybe a, a second entrance. Same thing, we need to go reinforced. So we'll do something like that and then uh, let's make sure that you get... Ooh, we've got a lot more things that we could throw up there. We can throw up in a lot of different ways. Okay, so I don't know if we should... Yeah, let's, let's put it right there. Kind of a few lights here and there. All right, boom. Let's finish editing. Let's build this. And uh, we should certainly not be able to run. We shouldn't run out of any wood. I know that we've been running out of wood so far. Okay, nothing's popped up. I love it. Uh, what do you want? Yes, we could definitely use additional padded vests. And I know I have fine items to sell. Oh, we've already built so many of those small uh, healing tonics. That's great. Here, like, I don't like the red lights anyways. And we can sell all 10 of these. We can sell all 10 of these. Very nice. Hermione's doing a great job so far. All right, so I'm going to buy both of these. And you know what? If I can, I'd like to do this. I'd like to buy... Let's just sell one more thing. I don't even care what it is. Like, we don't even need this potter's cutter. I mean, maybe I shouldn't be selling that, but, you know, it's fine. Okay. Like, we don't really need any of this stuff. Boom. Okay, so daily update time. And we'll buy that for an additional worker. Nice. So, you know, our town's looking pretty sexy. Mr. T has achieved Herbalist level 1. I love it. Uh, channels the spirit of forest and uh, gains natural regeneration. That's cool. All right. So, uh, he might be able to be our cleric one day. How awesome would that be? Mr. T just, like, in the background. Just messing stuff up. All right. Energy tonic. I like that. We need to start growing flowers. We definitely need to start growing flowers, which we're not. We are collecting a lot of the flowers like this. I think it would be a good idea at this point, though. Daily update. Did we satisfy it in time? Nope. We were close. We were close. Let's loot this stuff since we haven't looted it yet. Pretty sure we're going to be facing something here in the daytime. And uh, we need to chop this down, too. Let's take these flowers. I'm not entirely sure... If I want to start to sell or switch around my food situation here. With only one farmer and really not that many workers left to, to, to get more farmers out there. I just don't, I don't know. 
Now, one thing I wouldn't mind doing is maybe, like, we don't need these, we don't need as many pumpkins. There we go. Let's, 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 let's stop with the pumpkins, Drew. Come on. It's not Halloween. What is this? It's not Halloween. Here, we don't even have, well, you know what? Maybe we should go with the, uh, it can be used as a healing herb. Yeah, let's go with the blue flowers. And then, and then, yeah, I, I'll still, because we've got a lot of pumpkins, so we really don't need this many. I'm hoping that I don't regret this, but I've got more, um, farmland soon to come over this way. Which is so weird to say because it's inside of a, inside of inside of a tunnel. <laughs> so yeah, that's uh, kind of kind of a strange thing to think about. Uh, now wait a second. If I click on this, yeah, let's go ahead and save this because I'll probably build another one. I probably won't be able to do, get enough done. Uh, small home. It's funny because I began this campaign like yeah, I'm only gonna build these little mansions, but uh, you know I didn't need that much net worth anyways. So, I guess this is, for the most part, a pretty good thing. Now, this is the point where I'm really gr regretting having only four workers. It'd be great if we if we had more just, you know, hard labor workers. It'd make our job so much easier right now. Okay, so what is happening? Okay, so... Oh, nice, nice. Okay, so we should be able to take them down pretty easily. Just make sure you uh, go out and protect... Oh my gosh! Yeah, don't let them, uh, don't let them kill you. Hey, they're in our house. Oh, crap. What are you doing? Hey, drop it. Uh, wait a second. Oh, you're just a worker. Yes, please run for your life. Nice. Marky Mark. Footman level three. Let's level up the, the uh, who is it? Idris Alba, right? Damn. All right, cool. Come on, come on, come on. Level them up. We got this. Hey, where'd they run to? Oh, okay. She's still working. That's nice. There it is. All right, baby. It's time. It is time. Look at that move. Great moves. Keep it up. Okay, so let's... um. Um, Actually, you know what? We might need a blacksmith for this. Yes, I do think we need that. So if we go to Marky Mark, we change his job. Yes. Hmm. Well, let's see. Promotion. Well, we need to get this promotion as soon as possible. We have to buy the carpenter. Well, that's that, though. That might not necessarily... Yeah, and the, and the blacksmith is required for the knight. And a knight's shield crafted by the blacksmith. Okay. Well, we can get an archer going right now. Um, let's make sure that we do that. What do you mean you can't build this? Oh, reinforced doors now require iron ore. When was that a thing? That's cool. I like it. I mean, because it shouldn't be easy to build. Really loving the small balance changes. Really makes this, it really makes it all, like, all that much better. Jeez, that was loud. All right. So, uh, we will for sure build this. We need some leather. But we will be working on some leather. And uh, we should probably just hire a blacksmith. But, uh, yes, now we'll be able to fight much more efficiently. As soon as we uh, are able to upgrade these guys. But uh, anyways, guys, thank you so much for watching. Oh, we've got more people to fight. Perfect. So our Great Purge is going pretty well so far. I'm hoping that we don't have to take on, it, take on anything like that, that stone golem. That was really scary to see it do that much damage. Um, because we're not ready for something like that. But anyways, guys, thank you so much for watching. And I'll see you guys next time.